Starts in the 27. One point lead, 240 to go in the half. Wentz has time. Down the sideline he goes. Second and 18. Wentz is going to air it out deep downfield. Then it will be caught and into the end zone. The game. Fantastic play for a guy who's come out of nowhere. My only question, did he step out of bounds on about the two-yard line? Let's just take a quick look here. He's got a clean catch. Couldn't tell. It was close. Oh, no, he didn't. That was great. Empty backfield as Wentz throws to the outside, and the catch is made by one of the heroes from Landon. Second and ten. Wentz complete. It's Fulgham. So he's gone to Fulgham three straight times as third down and three. Wentz escapes, stays on his feet, throws, and it is Fulgham who makes the catch. Split backs, first and ten from the Steelers, 31, as Wentz throws, and it's Fulgham, bounces off the tackle, attempt by Minka Fitzpatrick. So Cameron Hayward. Wentz fires downfield, Fulgham wide open for an eagle. They, they look good. Third down and 12. As Wentz fires, and the catch is made, and it's Fulgham again. He's, you know, T.J. Watt in a three-point stance. Bud Dupree ready to go on a D-line stunt. And now Wentz throws, and again, it is Fulgham. What a catch. He goes over 100 yards for the day, and he picks up 18 at an Eagles first down. Just give Carson Wentz time, allow Fulgham to come up and out. They just need time. Defensive line is going. They hug rush the running back. And the time he has right there, Fulgham, uh, man, great route, man. He breaks it off, gets up there. Can't defense that. That's a great route here in the third quarter. From the 40, off the play fake. It's Fulgham again to the Steelers. The season for the Eagles. Second down and ten. Wentz throws Fulgham the catch. Right here in the slot, Mike Hilton's on coverage. And these routes right now, Mike Hilton frankly just can't cover. It's a good throw and catch. He's throwing it high away from Mike Hilton. There's no way that Hilton can play, make a play on that ball. And Butter has been RPO action. Carson Wentz using his legs. We saw Watt on the sidelines. Wentz, and there's Fulgham. Touchdown, Travis Fulgham. And nearly went the Heisman Trophy. Serious dual threat for the Sooners. For the second for the award. Wentz puts a mustard on it and hits Fulgham. As well, thus some of the better plays we're seeing. Wentz dials it up underneath. Fulgham, catch and run. But couldn't get out of on their roster. Brett Toth saw it last week on Tuesday night. Or was that this week? Tried to keep up. <laughs> Pass from Lent. But it stays in there, second and ten. Lentz, a lined up and delivery to the sideline. The 6'5, almost 240. There were those comparisons coming out of college. Lentz off his back foot, floats it to the end zone. Caught. Touchdown, Fulgham to someone that he has said that he trusts and having your quarterbacks trust is a big big deal and it's interesting because we asked Carson how did you know about him he said I didn't because he wasn't working with the ones but Nate Sudfeld our third string quarterback well the Eagles defense has only had to defend 13 pass is caught wide open and that is the first of the night for the new sensation track stop here get the ball right back Pass is caught. Long way to go for Fulgham. He won't get there. Well played. Wentz throws. Pass is caught. That was a beauty and a flip at the end of it by Fulgham. Here, one on one. Wentz pulls it down, throws, completes. And a yard. 
excited to see what Raider is. To the sideline, Fulgham, Raider is a big play. And it's Travis Fulgham. It's a nice route by Fulgham. And then you see the body control that he has being able to adjust and make a play on the ball. 40-yard complete. Second down and 14 right now. A four-man rush, and Wentz will fire down the sideline. Caught on the run, and taken out of bounds inside the five is Travis Fulgham. Release here. He's going to slowly come off and rock back Diggs on his heels. He, he just stayed on it so long and was so patient. By the time that Diggs was trying to turn and go run with him, he was in a bad position. He was back on his heels, and that's why Fulgham was able to take advantage. Proven that in spades. Second down and nine. Well play action. Wentz with a ton of time. No pressure. Fires caught midfield. Fulgham. The Kilman on Monday night against Arizona. Never in the game against Washington as the pass is caught about a yard to 40 miles an hour. Before the night is done. First and 15. Fulgham. And taken down from behind. That's a great. First down from the 42-yard line, and Hurts is going to throw and complete it along the sideline to Fulgham. Juan Diggs going to give him a lot of space out there. There's always questions, were they ever going to let Jalen Hurts just... Got it, such a big factor right here. And that pass longer for the end zone, and hold in by Fulgham. Six catches for him tonight. The same sort of patient release. Watch him. He's going to get right up on Diggs. And then just have the ability to sneak. Yes, it does. Second and four at the 37. Wentz to the sideline. Open there is Travis Fulgham. Another pass for Wentz. Looking for Fulgham underneath. Gets him at the 45-yard line in front of Ward. Pressure. Travis Fulgham, his first contributed in big ways. Second and 13. Wentz throwing and completing. Look like Buda Baker's in the middle. Here we go. Here we go. Hurts goes for it. Caught first down. Eagles still have life. Travis on the season of 14 weeks. Throwing and that pass complete, stepping out at the 31. From the 45 as Hertz pulls it in. Look at all the words of time. Fires wide open in Cowboys territory. Oh, yes. Philadelphia will host Washington. New York Giants still alive. I mean, will host you, Dallas. You think about, yes, we're talking in. From the 49, Ward is in motion, swing it to him. He can throw. A former quarterback downfield, and that'll be taken along the sideline.